Hello and welcome to yet another Views from the Veranda. Well look, I thought today with the way property prices have been moving and changing and increasing, I thought I'd explore um, the pros and cons of renting or buying a property. Um, obviously it's a big decision in life, so I thought I'd just look at, you know, logically what is actually involved. So in terms of the renting pros and cons, um, obviously with, with renting you have the mobility to be able to move around and the freedom to relocate yourself when and where you like. Um, landlord pays for maintenance. Um, it doesn't require expensive buying costs involved in buying a property. Um, there's no major fluctuations in um, household expenses, um, partly because um, things like uh, repairs and maintenance are covered by the landlord itself. Um, it, it allows you to test drive different sorts of properties as well to find out what, what suits you. Um, on the downside, um, you don't build equity, so you don't actually see the increase in what happens in property prices, especially lately. Um, you're limited in the ability to customise where you're living as well to suit your own circumstances. Um, rent could go up over time. Um, landlord might decide to sell, um, so you have no security of tenancy in some respects. Um, and so there's limited sort of stability and permanence about where you are. On the buying side, um, the pros in buying is you do build e equity up over the time as your property hopefully does increase in value. Um, you reap the benefits in some cases of some tax benefits, especially if you're buying a property as an investment. Um, you get unlimited freedom to customise where you live, so you can ba basically design a place to suit your own circumstances. Um, and it does have that sense of stability and permanence, especially if you have a family. Um, the downside is that the buying costs are expensive to buy a property, especially with stamp duty. Um, the responsibility for maintenance and repairs lies with you, and that's a lot of time, effort and money. Um, there's less flexibility to move, so you are tied down, so if your circumstances change, you do have the possibility, possibility of ha and hassle of selling a property. Um, home values can decrease, so you can lose money, um, although that doesn't happen very often. Um, and also there's been changes in the tax laws which might have an impact on you uh, moving forward. So there's the pluses and minuses of actually renting and buying. Obviously if you are looking to um, buy a property then you really need to explore the finances and the type of property that would suit you. So on that note, look, if you'd like to have a discussion about you know, your own situation, uh, about renting a property or about buying a property, contact us, Sebastian Just. We're here to give you the best advice the Shire can provide. But until next time, take care and look after each other. Thank you.